वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल साइंटिफिक अंडर स्कोर मैथ थैंक यू फॉर विजिटिंग माई यूट्यूब चैनल वी विल राइट अ मैट लैब कोड फॉर फंडामेंटल और देशिक पावर मैथड विद एन एर प्लॉट इन दिस लेसन वी जस्ट रोट कोड फॉर दी पावर मैथड विदाउट एन एर प्लॉट इन दी लास्ट लेक्चर ओके सो इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल ऑल्सो राइट दी मैट लैब कोड फॉर दी एर प्लॉट ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट ओके सो फर्स्ट वी राइट दी इनिशियल कमांड सी एल सी क्लियर ऑल क्लोज ऑल एंड दी फॉर्मेट शॉर्ट फॉर दी सोल्यूशन अप टू फोर डेसीमल प्लेस वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर ओके सो नेक्स्ट वी राइट दी गिवन डेटा फॉर एग्जाम्पल Uh, we have example like this one determine the largest or the a, a dominant eigen value of the matrix and this is the given matrix and this is our uh, starting vector or the initial vector okay so first we write the uh, given data for example this is the matrix a uh, that is the square matrix 3 cross 3 matrix and uh, this is our uh, initial vector or the starting vector we like this one uh, like uh, Uh, right in this way x not is which is equal to this one we can take any non zero vector okay so uh, next we have the tolerance that is the all allowable error in our solution which is equal to 0.001 uh, next uh, here i have used the length command and uh, to check the size of the matrix a okay because i want to generate uh, a column vector uh, for the tolerance okay so next we initializing the uh, uh for loop initializing the k and x for the iterations okay so here i have used k is equal to 1 and with the for new iteration which is equal to k plus 1 okay so here i have the initial vector that is the initial vector uh, x x for all rows comma 1 Uh, one column which is equal to x not and this is our starting vector like this is the our starting vector okay next we have the initial assumption in our solution okay that is equal to this one and uh, uh, next we will use uh, while loop with this condition okay when this condition will true then the iteration will stop okay so this is the uh basic power method formula that is equal to we can see that uh, x of i plus 1 which is equal to the matrix a into the starting vector that is x i r the initial vector okay so this is the basic power method formula and then we normalize the obtained vector at yes we know that when we multiply the matrix with the initial vector like this one And with the initial vector this is our initial vector and after this one we get a new vector after getting a new vector we normalize this vector by dividing uh, the uh, uh, this matrix with the largest uh, largest value of the this vector okay so here we will uh, first normalizing the obtained vector like this one and this is equal to vj which is equal to maximum absolute value of the obtained vector and next we write this one e is equal to this is our obtained vector new vector like this is our new vector x of i plus 1 or x of k plus 1 okay and then we obtained then we get a uh, value that is the largest eigen value Uh, for example e is equal to e of j comma 1 okay here if this and uh, this uh, this we indicate the largest uh, value of uh, this vector like this one here we can see that and this is the largest largest value of this vector okay so for to obtain uh, to obtain this value we use this command we will indicate we will be equal to we will be equal to 7 and this j will indicate show the uh, position of the 
and this largest eigen value for example here we can see that this is the second uh, position of uh, and the largest eigen value okay so next we have next we have e is equal to this is our new obtained vector that is x of k plus 1 and this is the uh, largest value e is equal to e j comma 1 means second value of this matrix second value of this column vector and then we divide the x of k plus 1 by the largest eigenvalue and this is how we normalize the obtained vector okay so next we uh, calculate the error in our solution by using this uh, uh, by using the norm okay so error is equal to norm of the of new vector minus the previous vector with infinity norm okay so next uh, we will print uh, the largest eigenvalue and that is uh, e and we also want to print the largest eigenvector that is x is equal to k okay and v is equal to x of k okay now uh, in this lecture uh, our basic motive is how we can plot this error okay so for this one we use and these commands error is equal to and this empty bracket with semicolon and then error is equal to and bracket error comma this error semicolon this error so this will produce a column vector for the error okay now we also we want to plot this error so for this we have the following commands this is the plot one two and k minus one number of iterations and this is our error and with the line width that is a two okay so next we want to label the uh, y axis with error value x axis with number of iterations and the title of this will be the basic power method and uh, then we also want to draw a we want to draw a arrow like this one we can see that here on the y axis is the error value and on the x axis is the number of iterations and uh, to plot this arrow we use command this one to plot this arrow okay so next we want to plot and uh, the number of we want also show the want to show the number of iterations in the graph so we use this command here we can see that the number of iteration is 15 and the last one is this command is to off the box for example if we remove this command then there will be box like that in the graph okay so uh, we want to remove this box so we uh, have used the command over here that is the box which is equal to off okay so let's run this code on matlab and we will check the results okay so this is the matlab code for the basic power method uh, with error plot okay so let's let's run this code and we can see that this is the error uh, error plot of the basic power method as the number of iteration is increasing the error in the solution is decreasing and after 15 iteration we can see that the error in the uh, solution is completely zero And here we have the largest eigenvalue and the corresponding eigenvector with uh, this is the matrix A and this is our the initial vector. Okay, so thank you so much for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel scientific underscore math for more videos about mathematics.